about the life, love, and pop pop culture. Hello everyone, my name is Danielle Delgado and today I'm behind the scenes of the So You Think You Can Dance photo shoot. Oh my god, I love it. Coming in like with excitement. Of course. <laughs> I mean look look at what's happening. Yeah. I'm top ten. Has it set in yet? Um, now, this is what, like, we just did a photo shoot, we are about to be all like, I had someone do my makeup, <laughs> I don't own any of these clothes, but they're mine now. But no, it's, it's incredible, it's literally incredible, because I've, you know, come from the bottom of being cut last season, and like, the struggle of that, and to now be one of the top ten, is, and the only tapper, representing tap, let's go. <laughs> it's just, it's so cool. It's so cool. That reminds me, I'm like, started from the bottom and now we're here. <laughs> Yay! Started from the bottom. Yeah, you know it. You know it. I know, this must be so crazy to have like all these like cameras, lights, you have yes. hair, makeup, wardrobe. So it's, different from regular life, right? It's so different. Yeah, because normally I wake up and I, I don't put anything on my face and I take a shower and let my hair dry. And so they're all like, what product do you use? And I was like, um, water <laughs> so like it's a whole different world it's a whole new experience and i'm living for it like i love it it's everyone here the energy in this room is incredible like the top 10 is my family we love each other we're all here to support each other it's it's amazing how are you feeling about this whole experience um it's been hard it's definitely been hard and challenging but um i wouldn't trade it for the world this experience is everything yeah what made you want to join the show my mom, my dance teacher, um, my little sister, um, they all inspired me to do it. And I've also just been watching this show since I was like four, little, since it started, since season one. Yeah. Yeah. What would you say has been the toughest part about the Academy for you? Um, the toughest part is definitely adapting to the different styles. Um, being a contemporary dancer, ballroom, cha-cha, it's very difficult to pick up. It's like learning a different language. How excited are you to be here? Oh, I'm so excited. Yeah, this is, I, I still can't even believe it. Yeah. What did you think when they first told you, okay, you're going to be part of the top ten? So you think you can dance? Honestly, the first thing I did was cry my eyes out because I was just so, so happy and so proud of myself. Yeah. What has been the toughest part so far and what are you looking forward to the most? The toughest part is just, you know, keeping that drive and just keep on pushing yourself because they they made it tough and of course they have to because this is, you know, the biggest thing for a dancer. And in order to achieve it, you have to push yourself to the fullest every single second of every day. So that was hard for me, but it was totally worth it. My B-boy, uh, hip-hop yes, dancer. Yes, B-boy. Shout out to all the B-boys and B-girls out there. So your name is Bailey, but you have a special yes. nickname that you like to go by. What's that? I go by Bail Rock. Yes. And, and how did you get that nickname? So basically, um, my name is Bailey. So my mentor gave me this name, actually. Really? So he took Bail, and he said every time I stepped on stage, I would always love to rock to the beat of the music and yeah. rock the stage because I love performing. Yeah. So we took Bail and rock together, and we took out the C just to make it a little bit interesting. Yeah. Hey. So Bail Rock came to be. Hey, man. And how are you feeling? Top 10, so you think you can dance? All of this feels just so surreal. Yeah. I mean, um, to be in a room with some of the most amazing not technical dancers, but the most amazing dancers yeah. I've ever seen. Uh -huh. And as a b-boy, and as an only b-boy and only hip-hop dancer, yeah. um, male hip-hop dancer, to be here is just an honor. And I hope I re represent it well. You guys like energy. You guys are oh, all yeah. so like... Oh, we're very excited. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Top 10, so you think you can dance. Has it set in yet? No. no. I think once I go home, uh -huh. and I'll be sitting in my bed, and I'll be like, whoa. Like I get to go back and like I'm gonna have one of those phone numbers, yeah. like with my name in it. Like vote for me. That's what you're looking forward to the most, the phone number. Whoa! Like it's gonna be on the bottom of the screen, with my name in it. Yeah. That's crazy. It's crazy. Oh. <laughs> it must be so like weird because you guys do this. You guys go to the photo shoot. Like it's so different from normal life, right? Yeah. It's yeah. It's definitely super weird. And like the fact that we're gonna just go home, like tomorrow, we're just gonna be at home, like back to regular life. But at the same time, in the back of our heads, it's like nothing is normal. Yeah. And nothing will ever be normal again, you know? Uh -huh. So it's just so weird. It's so weird to think about. Yeah. Just trying to like wrap my head around it for sure. But whew, I'm super excited. <laughs> Did you have any like fears going into this at all? Definitely had some fears. Yeah. Um, going into 
styles that I've never really done before. It was definitely nerve wracking being like, okay, what if I make a complete fool of myself on this television? But um, <laughs> luckily I didn't, so there's that. Um, but at the same time, regardless of what happened, I knew that I wanted to push myself as a person and as a dancer. So no matter what, even now from top 10 and top 10 and beyond, like whatever happens, like I want to just be able to say that I grew as a dancer and I grew as a person and I got the experience regardless of what happens. Yeah. Well, that's a wrap for me today. Thank you guys so much for watching and don't forget to tune in next time as we discuss more life, love and pop culture. If you enjoyed my interview, subscribe to my YouTube channel and don't forget to look out for new videos every Wednesday.